Now, as the pandemic rages on, some EMTs and paramedics, they are feeling the pressure with limited staffing and delays. Our ABC 10 reporter Sierra Encinas tells us how local emergency service provider Falk is being impacted by the pandemic. Falcon employees are working to make it to every call and they're making it in their response goal time, but the pandemic is presenting several challenges. In fact, the ambulance provider says more than half of its employees have tested positive for the virus. It's been two months since Falk took over ambulance operations in San Diego. Things are going much better uh, than a few months ago. It was very challenging, um, you know, kind of getting up in a ramp up. It's like starting a new business. Jeff Bem, Falk San Diego's managing director, says the virus has impacted staffing levels. Not only has call volume gone up 30% since December, he says his employees are getting sick. 25% of the 400 people that, that are paramedics and EMTs have been out of work at some point or another since the middle of December through to just yesterday. Falk is also waiting longer to turn over patients because hospitals are feeling the same burdens. We are waiting in a hospital to turn our patient over up to eight hours. But I would tell you it's more like, yeah, it's more like three to seven, three to six on average, but some have been waiting there all shift. He says while COVID is a burden to the system, Falk is meeting its average response time goal. The organization has a three-tier priority level of calls they respond to. Life-threatening taking priority, then urgent priority, and finally non-life-threatening emergencies. So we might say to you, okay, we'll be there as quickly as we can, but maybe we're not going to see you for like an hour or an hour and a half or something like that. But that's a non-life-threatening. In this city, in, in, this, in this operation, this EMS operation, you're always going to get a unit very quickly when it's a life-threatening emergency because we've got a great dual response system with the fire department and with Falk. Falk is hiring on more first responders to meet the demand it's seeing. My paramedics and EMTs who are working really, really hard, and they're tired by the way, but they're out there for the public to do as much as they can. Falk says it's adding a dozen new EMTs to its team on Monday. Sierra Encinas, ABC 10 